Hi, everyone. Welcome to CJUSD Connect. We are excited to bring you a new kind of professional development through the Aludo Learning Platform. Our goal is to streamline and enhance the focus of professional development across the district. Let's take a look at all that CJUSD Connect has to offer. CJUSD Connect is a game that was collaboratively put together by various departments in the district. One of the greatest benefits of this team effort is having one centralized hub for professional development across the district. This game will house trainings that can be accessed on demand on the participants schedule, open levels allow for personalization, provided district support and feedback with each activity, and a game that develops as needed as to not grow stagnant. All participants will start at level one, which has some game basics. And then after you meet a few requirements, the other levels will open up. As the levels increase, the offering of activities will become more robust and the activities themselves will become more advanced. But participants can navigate between the levels according to their interest. Right now, level one and two are opened up, but level three will be completed by the end of September. In level one, the missions are focused on building some game basics. There are also some back to school activities and some strategies and tools that will help you with distance learning. Once a player has completed the game basics and they have access to levels two through five, levels two through five will be structured like this, giving the player access to all these different missions in which the departments have created activities for learners to explore um, and go deeper. Every level gets uh, more rigorous and players can choose what uh, meets their needs. For example, a way that the ed services PK through six has come together and developed activities. You might see different choices amongst pedagogy, digital citizenship, curriculum, and even some of the tools that you can use to execute these uh, learning activities and experiences with your, your students. Curriculum is in there, and here's an idea of some activities you may see. We will specifically address curriculum that has been adopted and how you can learn the basics and even go deeper with those uses and platforms. If you're looking at just becoming more fluid in your Google tools, your G Suite tools, then we've got a lot of options for you with starting again with the basics and working through applying them in a higher level way. Digital citizenship is where you'll specifically find CJUSD requirements for DigSit. So this is just an example of some of the activities you may see that target our PK through six. Missions are for both elementary and secondary participants. All the activities are generic unless you see something like elementary or secondary or middle school in the name of the activity, such as at your library explore SOARS by Overdrive 7 through 12 or the virtual job shadow for middle school. Here are some activities in the mission instructional tools where you can see the growth of a mission across two levels to see the depth and progression. Language Support Services has created some activities in both level two and level three. It's under the EL, ELD mission. Um, level two, which is on the left, on the left, it's a bit more basic. So you have things like who are English learners, what is the LPAC, what is integrated and designated ELD. So a lot of basic level knowledge. Level three on the right gets progressively more complex, talking about instructional ideas for distance learning and English learners. And as levels four and five come on board, it'll get even more complex after that. In CJUSD Connect, participants get to choose what they want to learn about special education. We have a little bit of something for everyone. So if you'd learn, like to learn about special education basics, we have that in there. If you'd like to go in and learn more about Google's accessibility features or practice adding a accessibility extension to your Chrome browser, 
We have that in there for you. Do you want to go further in your knowledge of social emotional learning, PBIA, or teacher wellness? Then Student Services has a mission designed just for you. The IT department has included various learning activities that are useful to classroom teachers like learning um, cue class attendance, um, but also for the front office, the support staff or management, like using WebEx or um, Google Apps. Getting Getting to CJUSD Connect is easy for everyone in Colton Joint Unified School District. You simply need to go to your class link, um, click on class link, go in there, find CJUSD Connect, click on that, and you're in. Uh, once in, you're going to want to create your account, uh, select your home school or the school that you're most associated with, and that'll connect you not only to your school, but your colleagues. So as you play the game, um, you'll be connected to them. And a great way to keep motivated and also see who has accomplished an activity is by looking at your dashboard. So you can see on there activities that your, co that your colleagues have completed, and it also helps keep your school on the leaderboard. <laughs> on the game board, you can see your scores. The number in purple is the level or mission points required. And the number in green shows the number of points that you have earned. There's only a few that are required in order to move through the board, and those required activities will have a black box that says required next to them. Learning activities are the various activities where users can select what they would like to learn. Resources is the learning experience where participants can read or experience the learning in their activity. And then record achievement is how the participant submits their work showing the learning they have done. There are different ways to submit this work. They can do it through pasting a link, taking a screenshot, uploading an image, or uploading a file or a video. Activities are approved and reviewed weekly. You will notice a host of icons that are to help guide you through your gameplay. Occasionally, you may have an activity that has been paused. Your approver will approve or will offer you some helpful feedback on ways to complete your tasks so you can resubmit for completion. And now we're actually going to take you live to go look at those specifically on a Ludo. Let's take you class link where we told you you could all access your access your um, a Ludo dashboard. So mine is here in class link. Once I get to my Link dashboard. I'm finding that CJUSD Connect icon and clicking on it. That will then have me make sure to log in with Google. And when I get there, I will automatically pull up into games that I've already contributed or played. So, for example, if this is your first time, it will take you straight into CJUSD Connect, where you will see that dashboard that we just spoke about the leaderboard that's currently happening, and I'll click play to get started. When I'm there, it shows me again my, my profile, any late, latest badges that I have um, completed, and then I can see my game split up by level, mission, and activities that fall within. Here are the points that were also described to you. And for example, let's just click on an activity to see what it looks like. So I'm clicking here on welcome to CJUSD Connect. I can see the point value that this is going to receive, I will receive after I've completed it, and even an estimated time of completion for this activity. Here's the learning activity that I need to read through to understand what I will be learning on this 
training on this activity. Any resources that are provided, this one does not have any resources for me to use other than the reading here. And then my submitting of evidence, I would go ahead and follow these directions on what I'm supposed to enter in this box and then click record achievement. What's also helpful is I can see some people that have recently completed this activity. So if you ever feel stuck and you need a little extra support, what a great way to reach out to one of these players in Colton and ask them for advice on how to complete this. So that wraps up for us here. One platform, multiple departments, directed professional development. We are CJUSD Connect. Thanks for all joining us. We're here to support you. And thank you so much for listening in and we're here to help.